What's going on adventurers? We are currently at Ellsworth Cemetery, which is a historic cemetery here in Westminster, Maryland. And apparently it's all African American, dating back to the 1800s. So um, they actually just recently, I don't know, it's so weird. It's like, I was reading about it. I came across an article and apparently it was kind of forgotten. Like nobody had been maintaining it, which is really uh, sad, but at the same time, recently, they decided to do a rededication. So we thought maybe we would try to come visit and see what the residents of Ellsworth think of that. See if anybody wants to talk to us. And we just want to let them know that they are not forgotten. So we're going to use our equipment of a meter and a spirit box and see if anybody wants to communicate with us. So come on along. Yeah, let's go check it out and see if anybody wants to talk to us. We'll show you some of these very old stones. Let's see what year these are. Oh my goodness, is this the actual grave? Or is this the foot? Is this the actual grave? Isn't that awful? That makes me sad. People just destroyed it. Unless there's actual, this is actually a marking burial, but I don't think. Oh, right. Know, like, you know, around this or... Now that's, that, that may be true. What Lisa just said, she said, possibly it could be unmarked graves, which I think you might be right about that. Cause I think these days they have technology. They can actually see under the ground. Right. And figure out where bury, you know, they're buried. Well, that's so sad that they don't have even a yeah, marker. I bet you would have something. Cause this one, they actually put orange paint <gasps> You're right. See? Yes, there they're is orange paint. trying to figure out what's what with that. So they're trying to, um, I don't know. I, I, I'm really hoping that these people who do not have a marker, I'm really hoping that they do receive one. Maybe that's what they're working on here. Yeah, I know. I, that's what I'm thinking. The way there's space back here. And it's only, it's mostly back here. Yeah. Versus the front where the, they There's do a have couple. Some, There's a couple up there. There's a few, but not like back here. Yeah. So maybe we should try back here. These okay, let's, the yeah, let's try to talk to somebody back here and I mean, see I'm what they. I'm getting a little bit of a chill back here, so. I feel something back feel here it? for sure. Yeah. yeah. I'm feeling a little I'm bit. feeling some kind of energy. Doesn't feel like bad energy. I just feel energy, like a heaviness a little bit. Yeah. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and get the spirit box started up and see if anybody wants to make communication with us now. So this one, guys, says 1872. That is quite a while ago. Anyone want to communicate with us? We do. Hello? Anybody want to say hello? Donald? Donald? Hi, Donald. Um, I just want everybody to know that we mean nothing but respect. We just want to let you know that you have not been forgotten. And we're very sorry that a lot of these graves had been unmarked for so long. And we're really happy that they decided to rededicate the cemetery. So I, we just want to know what you guys think about that. Do you like visitors? How many spirits are here? Ten. Did you say ten people were here? I'm gonna say your names. Tell us your names. So we can say hello. Great. You remember living here? Is there anything you would like people to know? Can you come through and just just let us know you're here? We know some of you were here from the 1800s before the Civil War. If you want to say hi. We're friendly. We just came to visit you. Tell us your name. Can you tell us your name? Is somebody standing next to me right now? I just felt a, a breeze right next to me. 
Are you standing next to me? Me? Did you say me? What's your name? Just felt a bit of a breeze next to me, guys, and I don't know, it just feels like somebody's standing next to me. There's some wind on these. If you look at some of these yellow ribbons, well, up there, there's a ribbon blowing. Somebody moving this ribbon that wants to say hello. Can you tell us your name? What do you say? Oh, man's name. This one's right next to it, and it's not moving at all. Can you say hello? It's so weird. I can feel you guys here. I feel your presence. I know you're here. Probably not used to having people come visit, but um, this is a good chance for you to say hello. They said who's there. I'm Jen and this is Lisa. I think it's at Lisa. Hi, Jen. Hi. Hi. Oh, I'm getting like tingles. I said hi, Jen. It's nice to meet you all. That was so polite. Is there anything else that you want to say to us? I want to, I want to say Merry Christmas to you all and Happy New Year. Who's making the flags blow? Can I say your name? We'd like to hear your name. Eric. 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 Is that Eric? Hi, Eric. Nice to meet you. I'm very sorry if we step on any of your plots. Anybody else want to say hello? <laughs> Stay on here. I'm going to see if I can see any stones that say Eric. What was that? Oh, mine? Did you say mine? Is it around here? Is this Harry? No, Mary. Is there a Mary? Is Mary around today? Want to say hello? Mary. Hi, Mary. She was born in 1838 and died in 1912. She had a really long life. Does it say 74? Hello. Are you going to keep on going? Okay. Henry? heard Frank but right before you said that. Yeah. Hello, I think I need to say hello. Frank? Is that you? Yeah. He said this is Frank. Anybody up here want to say hello? It's interesting, there's just a few little birds up in that tree at the very top. I'm seeing a rainbow over here. Check it out, guys. This just happened. It's getting bright over there, too. I don't see it over there. Oh, yeah, I do. There's these rainbows all of a sudden in the sky. It's pretty crazy. There's one there. And then there's also one over here, right there, above my finger. And it didn't rain. And it didn't rain, and <laughs> I don't know, like I just have a really good feeling right now. Yeah. I feel like everybody here really appreciated us yeah. coming to see them. I think they're putting it out there. All right guys, I think we got quite a bit of response 
from a lot of spirits out here today. I feel a lot of positive vibes here. I feel like everybody here is just so happy and so thankful that somebody's remembering them and appreciating them. And, you know, we just wanted to let them know that they're not forgotten and, you know, they're loved. So, um, thank you so much for joining us today, guys. And with that being said, we'll see you on our next Raptor, Raptor Adventure. Adventure.